What is prostate cancer and who is at risk? Let's go over the basics. Prostate cancer is a result of abnormal cells forming in the prostate gland. These cells take over the body's normal cell function, so it's harder for the prostate to work as it should. There are two types of these growths, also called tumors, cancerous growths that are called malignant tumors, and non-cancerous growths, which are called benign tumors. Benign tumors, such as benign prostatic hyperplasia, or BPH, are not a threat to life and do not spread to other parts of the body. They can be removed and may grow back slowly, but often do not. Malignant tumors can spread or metastasize to nearby organs and tissues, such as the bladder or rectum. If removed, they may grow back again. Malignant tumors may spread far beyond the prostate. This can be life-threatening and is known as metastatic disease. Unfortunately, one in eight men will get diagnosed with prostate cancer in their lifetime, so learning facts about prostate cancer may be helpful. There are many notable risk factors for prostate cancer. People over the age of 65 make up over half of those with prostate cancer. People who are African American or Caribbean of African descent are at a much higher risk. One in six will develop prostate cancer in their lifetime. The risk more than doubles for those who have a grandfather, father, or brother who has been diagnosed with prostate cancer. Early screenings help. With early diagnosis and proactive health care, the rate of treatability can be high. Also, it is of great value to know that useful screening tools are continuously evolving with great success. Join us for the other videos in this series, where we review helpful screening and diagnostic tools for prostate cancer. The Urology Care Foundation is the official foundation of the American Urological Association. Patient resources made possible by the generous support of Lanthius.